back at it with Pet G. Um, been trying a few things today, um, adjusting whilst on the fly, and I've made some good improvements. As you can see, halfway across this print, all that fluffy crap here. I seem to have got rid of it finally when it comes around to this end and it was simply because I needed to lower the or raise the Z height should we say by 0.5 in here let's turn oh, sorry wrong one control motion Z offset that's what I had to change Obviously printing slower anyway, um, but I'm printing way too slow at the moment. Um, this is down, I think, about 30 millisecond. Um, in vase mode, it's really good. Um, it looks brilliant from the outside all the way around. There's no flaws with it at all, other than this fluffy shit here, which obviously I'm pretty sure I've sorted out now, but it's by changing that on the fly. So the next print I'll do, I'll start off by adjusting that. Um, but I've done a couple of items now in Pet G, but the colours look so cool. So yeah, there's the difference between dragging the nozzle across the Pet G, which Pet G doesn't really like, and not dragging the nozzle across Pet G. Could possibly go a bit more. Uh, but yeah, all trial and error with this stuff, unfortunately. Every print is different. Well, so I say. 